Hello students, dear friends. Today we've come up with a very good lesson which talks about the use of I have something to. When you say I have something to, it means that you have an idea or an action or something to share to someone. Okay, that is the meaning of I have something to. We use I have something to plus the verb in infinity. You I have something to to do to give you to share you uri kubwira abantu hari ikintu ufite cyo kubabwira cyo kubaha hari igitekerezo ufite ugakoresha ijambo cyangwa ugakoresha iyi phrase ari yo i have something to iyi ntero ngufi uburi kuvuga utere tujye kubireba mu magambo arambu cyangwa se mu ntero zitandukanye kugira ngo uje ubikoresha mu cyongereza cyangwa i have something to i have something to drink I have something to share with you. That's what we are going to be talking about. Try to follow us. Don't let us down. We do tell so let's start. Good. When you say I have something to or I have something verb. You use this phrase, I have something to, to do, to give you, to share with you. When you are talking about, or when you are telling the hearer, someone who hears, umunu uumva, uri kugira, yuri kufuga, chawa si yuri kugiru munu, that you possess. Here we say possess. We don't say possess. Possess. It's like you have. Hmm? Possess. That you possess something or an idea to share with him or her. Uba uri kubwira umuntu ko ufite ikintu cyangwa se igitekerezo ushaka kumusangiza. That is the use of I have something to yeah, I have something plus a verb, a verb. I have something plus a verb. Uburi guhereza umuntu cyangwa kubwira umuntu icyo wamugeneye cyangwa se icyo ushaka kumusangiza. We are going to see more examples here uh, which talk about uh, the use of I have something to. For example, you may say, I have something to ask John. I have something to ask John. That's a very good English, my friend. Try to use this, uh, this kind of sentence when you are telling somebody that there is something that you are having or an idea that you are having which you are going to share with someone. Okay, I have something to, to ask John. Another example here they say, I have something good to give you. I have something good to give you. For example, you've got a machine you want to give to someone as a gift. Of the machine, or a shakuya zoom, computer, shakuya zoom, nakado chava se iman. You may approach him or her, shaku gaja kum guti, my friend. I have something good to give you. Harichin chiza fite, shakaku go. I have something good to give you. Good. And me also, I have something good to give you, which is a lesson. Good. Let's continue. You may say, I have something to eat tomorrow. Even if I'm hungry today, but I have something to eat tomorrow. I have something. Good. I have something to drink today. If you talk to me, Moses, no one has achieved what I could have defeat. I have something to drink today. In Habur, we shall have to go against your team. You are hiding that that thing that you are having, or an idea that you are having, but you have it. 
Are you correct it in mind? Changa say physically you have it. For example, if I have this duster, I may say I have something to use to clean my my board. Hari chino vipe ndi muzebu busibisha ichiwao chan. That is a duster, but I haven't mentioned it. Have very kona ivuze. Hari kona ivu jeti hari chon vipe na chwaz. We will do vipe na chwaz o bi bi gumane because I have something to to use. Viti chogo kore. Uh, do you want a phone? No, no problem. I have something to use for communication. I don't need your phone. I have to, something to, to use. You see? Good. I have something to ask John. I have something good to give you. I have something to eat tomorrow. I have something to drink today. These are good sentences that you should memorize. Because they are going to help you in your daily life communication. If you want to increase or uplift your English, it's better to use the use of, to memorize the use of, uh, I have something to. Ichugo ucho utagomba kuiwa jibwa murigo. Ichugo mba kuiwa. Something that you should remember, which I'm going to remind you. Chonje kukuiwa. When you say, I have something plus infinitive, uonje lao infinitive. Don't say, I have something, ask John. No, no. Two should be there. To ask, to go, to drink, to eat, to give you, to share with you. Yes, I have something we could share now. Nishingiri mumbundo. Infinitive. Let's continue. We are going to see more examples on this. Good. Let's follow. Mukurichi. When I say, I have something to share with you. Katukurichi hanga. I have something to share with you. This means that viti chincho kubusanjiz. Maybe it's an idea. Maybe it's a beer. Maybe it's a water. It's water. Maybe it's a, it's milk. Maybe it's food. Maybe it's banana. I could have a yivuzi. I have something to share with you. Harichinushaka kugusangiza. An idea, beer, water, honey, milk. I don't know. Ariko muriwe abajifite mubjukuri. Ariko akawaza kuchiguisha. Maybe it's a gift. Then it's better to mention the gift before giving it to someone. Good. You may say, I have something to try on. I have something to try on. When you say, I have something to, to try on, I have something to attempt. Just I want to attempt or to try to try on this thing. I have something to try on. I was to try on, I was a uh, French language, which is essay, try on. Essay. Good. Number seven, you may say, I have something special to say in your wedding. I have something special to say in your wedding. I have something special to say in your wedding. What's the guy is jambori? Come in. As I forgot, I'm going to go. John will come, will stand up in front of other people and say something which is special. Something special which is special. When you say these, these are special people, you say we are special. We are the sons. Special events. We be sons. We will be the sons or parties or ceremonies. I have something to. Uh, I have something special to say in your wedding. You you not be mungo. I have something to. Uh, I have something special for you. If you give me a mug, you think I need to give you the sons. You think I have something. Special for beginners. 
for those who are learning English at the first time. Munshuro ya gambere, abanye shuri, bari kwi kichon yeleza kunshuro ya go gambere. Ufakaka kam. I have something to tell you. Oh, you may say, my husband, today I have something to tell you. At evening hours, or in evening, evening hours. Mumasai mugoroba, harichinu, ndibuze kukugi. Icho jie, araza, kujitega, amatu. Let's continue. We are going to see different uh, exercises, uh, different sentences. Tujie kukoro mitozo, uri mumeruro, zijera muresha tu. Kujira kutumenye, the use of, I have something true. Ushize huna verb. We are going to see this. This exercise is going to help us to know the use of uh, the use of I have something to. Uyumi tozu ye kudu fasha kumenya imi kure shereze ya I have something to to do, to buy, to think about things like that. For example, to buy. We are going to use the word to buy here, this verb. To buy, to think about, to eat. Now, how you are going to complete? Ujie kuzuza. Urabanzurego. Nagaru pa kuzuza. You are going to think about, okay, the sentence. Urabanzutechele ze kuri ineruro ubanzume ni usovan. The meaning of this sentence. After that, umenicho ushira mohano, mohano. Maybe let me direct you here. Just you put something here in the gap. This is a gap. Murikichuho. And you put something here. Bivu ya muri bivu that one, two, to think about and to eat. Okay? And you, you try to complete here. For example, if I say, I have something before I decide. I have something. Before I decide, may you say I have something to buy before I decide? May, uh, may you say I have something to think about before I decide? Or I have something to eat before I decide? Is it the resource? I will to the most sure to do here. I'm going to be a job. I'm going to be here. You're going to say, I'm going to give you three seconds. Okay? Three seconds. Only three seconds. One, two, three. One, two, three. What can we put here to have the complete or uh, the meaningful sentence? You say, I have something to think about. I have something to think about before I decide. Mfiti chini ngomba kutechele zaho mbere yo kwanzura, chango yo kufatu mwanzura. Before I take a decision, I have something to think about. Kuko uwa kufatu mwanzura wa majo kutechele za. It's better to say, I have something to think, I have something to think about. I have something to think about. That was the first thing. Uh, answer. I have something to think to think about. Let's go to the second question here. Okay, I give you three seconds. One, two, three. I have something even if I'm hungry. No go chonje. Vite. Haricho vite. Something to to eat. Yes. I have something to eat even if I am hungry. The last sentence is this one. I have something dash dash before they close the market. I give you three seconds. One second. Two. Three. I have something to buy. Yes, I have something to buy before they close the market. Vite, harichinu, vite kugura. Chango se, harichinu, ngomba kugura, mbere yuko 
bafunga isoko urabona ko ubikoze gutya niba wabikoze ihamashi aho ngahuri ubice muri Sarawenda cyangwa uri mu murima cyangwa se uri muri restaurant i don't know where we were but you should clap for yourself because of these three sentences that you have already done correctly it's very wonderful very better to try to use this uh, expression which is i i have something to to do to think about uh, i have something to share with you i have something to to give you things like that thank you very much i'm teacher jasper we are together for the next lessons of english language and those who want to learn kiswahili we are there on pan entertainment to teach you two languages because these two languages are international we are having or we are teaching you two international languages that are going to help you change your life improve different people from different countries like uh, those people who uh, who want to to gain or to receive friends from different areas of this world when you know english you get friends wherever you are in whatever you are doing it's better to learn english on pan entertainment thank you very much we are together Turikumwe ubwo ngubwo eh nahutaha kandi somo ryacu nakagaruka umushya gukanda kukantu kumuntu kukaranga subscribe nokuona masomo yose kuri pan kuva imeshi cyane ayo turi gushiraho yose uzayabona nokanda kuri subscribe nunda kanda bizaguchanga nkuko biza kuyobera cyangwa se ntabwo mu byukuru uzazamura ururimi rwawe neza thank you very much we are together